the jackpot. As gamblers, we're always chasing that big hit that'll fix all our problems. The only issue with that is that the big win usually just creates bigger losses eventually. Today, we're gonna tackle a subject that affects millions of people worldwide, gambling addiction. Specifically, we'll explore the dangerous mindset of being one spin away from the jackpot or hitting it big. Now, we all know that gambling can be exciting. It can be thrilling and that's what keeps us going back. The anticipation, the rush of adrenaline, and the dream of striking it rich can be really alluring. But for some people like myself, excitement can really quickly turn into a vicious cycle that traps us in this mindset where we believe that we're one big win away from solving all our problems. Gambling addicts often fall into the trap of believing that winning big is just around the corner. I post a lot of videos online and the main comment that I get from the internet trolls out there is that, I'm just one spin away from winning big, or, you know, 99% of gamblers quit right before the big win. They convince themselves and attempt to convince me that if they could only hit a big jackpot or have one massive win, everything would change. Their debts would disappear, their financial worries would evaporate, and they could finally regain control over their lives. But here's the hard truth. That mindset's a dangerous illusion. Countless stories from recovering gambling addicts tell us that even if they do manage to hit that big win, it rarely solves any problems. In fact, it often makes things worse because for us, wins are just future losses. And likewise, big wins become even bigger future losses. I remember one time I hit a jackpot. It was a huge jackpot. I was exhilarated. And for a brief moment, I actually felt like I had it all figured out, that I'd made some major strides financially and my luck had finally turned. But as many people will probably repeat in their own story, within days, I found myself back at the casino chasing that high, believing that, you know, lightning could strike twice, and guess what? I lost everything I'd won. And by using cash advances on a credit card in frustration, I actually made things much, much worse. To my disbelief, I was in debt after just a few days. You see, the allure of that one big win creates a really dangerous cycle. It reinforces the belief that gambling's a viable solution to all of our financial problems that ironically were caused by gambling. Rather than recognizing it as a source of our struggles, it's like chasing a mirage in the desert. You're hoping that that next big win's gonna come, but it never does arrive. Gambling addiction can lead to severe financial difficulties, strained relationships, and of course, mental health issues. The compulsion to keep chasing that elusive win becomes this vicious cycle that can really easily spiral out of control. This leaves us in a way worse position than before we started, even if there were wins along the way. Breaking free from this mindset is absolutely crucial for gambling addicts because on the road to recovery, it requires a huge shift in perspective to get there. It also requires a realization that true happiness and stability can't be found through gambling. Instead, seeking support, professional help, and building healthier habits are essential steps toward regaining control. And of course, these are all things that I've talked about here on my channel before. So if these are of interest to you, please do smash that subscribe button to stay up to date on the content that I create. Everything I do here is aimed at helping you to live a happier and healthier life without the chaos of your addiction. Now, one of the most important things for a gambling addict to recognize is that they're not in control of their gambling behaviors. We need to understand that the cycle of chasing that one win will only lead to more losses and pain. It's about breaking the illusion and finding healthier ways to cope with the challenges that come along in life. There's always going to be problems in life. That's just unavoidable. But when you're in active addiction, you're creating mountains of problems as a result that you're adding to your life. You're making things worse. If you or someone you know is struggling with a gambling addiction, please reach out for help. There's support groups, there's helplines, and there's professionals out there who can guide you toward a healthier path. In the near future, I'm gonna be creating content with organizations such as the group that runs 1-800-GAMBLING. I recommend giving them a call if you're ever looking for guidance on getting clean. Remember, a true win in life is not measured by the size of your bank account, but by your overall well-being, because you're always gonna be able to make more money, but you can't buy health and you can't buy time. You're never gonna get back that time that you spend gambling. Don't waste the time that you have on earth doing something that's out of your control. Before we wrap this up, I wanna emphasize one final point. It's essential for society as a whole to address the root causes of gambling addiction. By creating supportive environments, implementing stricter regulations, and mainly by providing education on gambling addiction, we can actually prevent more people from falling into the trap of chasing that one big win, that jackpot. If you can think of specific ways that we should be educating the public about gambling addiction, please let me know what you do down in the comments below. I've been talking to a lot of people within the industry and I have their ears. So if you have good ideas, please share them with me. Again, true happiness and fulfillment they come from within ourselves and our relationships, not from the unpredictable world of gambling. Let's all break free from this illusion, support those in need, and work towards a healthier future for everyone involved. And with that, I'll see you tomorrow. Let's keep getting better together, one day at a time.